Hello and welcome back to the second channel. Back at it again. Now today is a very anticipated video. Today we are heading on Tinder as a Karen. Literally the video when I went undercover on Facebook group for Karen, the top comment, I've never seen a comment with so many likes on my channel. 2,500 likes saying you have to be a Karen on Tinder for a bit. So I'm here to deliver the goods. Today we are going undercover as a Karen on Tinder to find love, to troll people and just experience what Tinder is like for a Karen. So first things first, we need to go to Tinder.com and we need to make the Karen account. Now I know you're thinking, George, why don't you just change your name and age on your normal Tinder account to Georgia? Well, I would, but you literally can't on Tinder. I think it's to try and stop catfishes, but you can't change your name, you can't change your age, but it's not going to stop us. All right, here we are. Create account. All right, I've got to put my phone number in. I hope this doesn't delete my actual Tinder account. All right, continue. Oh, what the hell? It's just logged me into my Tinder account. So you have to use a different phone number. I don't have another phone number. Oh, I think the only thing we can do is delete account. Oh, we're gonna have to say goodbye to my verified tick self. I think we're gonna have to press this. I don't, I don't want to do it. I've worked so hard on this Tinder account. I've got so many videos out of it, millions of views. But it's for a good cause. It's for Georgia. Georgia needs to go on Tinder. So delete account. Are you sure you want to delete your account? If you delete your account, you will permanently lose your profile. This can not be undone. All right, delete my account. It is done. My Tinder is gone. I've deleted it. And on that note, it's time to create a new one as Georgia. Welcome to Tinder. Please follow these house rules. Number one, be yourself. Make sure your photos, age, and bio are true to who you are. All right, whatever. We're not going to listen to any of them rules. First name, Georgia. Gender, woman. Birthday, let's go the 16th of May. What year though? What age should Georgia be? I, maybe like 44, I think. That's like a Karen age. All right, let's get George's picture. Oh, she's so beautiful. If I say so myself. If anyone confused, by the way, who hasn't seen the other videos, I'm Georgia. I literally just put a face filter on that makes me a woman. There you go. Add passion. Right, what would Georgia like? Wine. Oh, Karen's, they love their wine. Dog lovers. Yeah, Karen's love dog. Uh, what else? Is complaining on here? <laughs> Is complaining an option? Brunch. Oh, that's such a Karen thing to do. Let's go for brunch. All right, and continue. And we are in. Georgia is on Tinder. This is what you all wanted to see. I hope it was everything you dreamed of. Georgia Georgia is officially on Tinder. Oh my gosh, look at this. Let's add some more photos. All right, let me get my other picture. This one, there you go. There she is. All right, let's add some about Georgia. 44 years young. Let's add some heart emojis in there. I live by the motto, live, laugh, love. I do a lot of the first two, but looking for someone to love. To be right for me, you need to love your family and a daily bottle of of wine or two. Haha! <laughs> Let's get some more hearts in there. And of course, the wine emoji. Anthem. Oh, we can select a Spotify anthem. What can our Spotify anthem be? Should I go for Kids Bop? They can't hear me because they're listening to Kids Bop. Oh, let's go for Old Town Road by Kids Bop. So that is the profile set up now. Let's get swiping. Let's see if we get any matches. Maximum distance. We're going all the way. Looking for everyone. Age range 13 to 54. Let's make that 18 to 54. Georgia doesn't discriminate. She just wants as many matches as she can get. We've got two likes already. How has she already got two likes? It says so much about this when she gets more likes than me. I'm literally her, but she's just a woman version of me. I thought she was an uglier version of me as well. Clearly not. Clearly I'm the ugly one. We got a match. Mateo, he's 33, 10 years younger than Georgia, but he's into it. Hey, Mateo, wanna go on a date? <gasps> Someone just messaged me. You're beautiful. <laughs> and Mateo replied, wow, it was quick. Yes, definitely. How has this happened? First message I've sent in two minutes, they've replied. I've got a day sorted. All right, I'm going to go away for a few days, have some conversations, and I'll be back to show you what it's like being Karen on Tinder. Okay, we are now back. It's been about a week and a very interesting week to say that. I thought being a Karen on here would be hard. I thought I'd have to really reach out and try and get people to talk to me, but no. I don't know if Georgia is just like really beautiful and everyone just loves her. We've got 99 plus likes. And the thing is, it's not even just like people that are her age. It's literally, look, this person, 20. I mean, to be fair, this person's called Roblox Boy. I'm always down for a good time. What's your idea of a good time? Playing Roblox? I mean, he super likes me. I've got to like him. All right, let's message um, Roblox Boy. Thanks for the super like, babes, XXX. Here we match with someone and they said, Hi there, I know I'm pretty young, but I love older women and you are gorgeous. So Georgia said, Are you calling me old? No, absolutely not. You are young and beautiful, which I like. You've probably been told this, but you are stunning. <laughs> He's really trying to dig in 
himself out this hole. So what's your passion? I like complaining a lot. What's your passion? I wanted to let him know I was a Karen to see if that would affect him. But it really didn't. Maths. I love maths. I didn't realise anyone actually loved maths. So I said, why? It's something that I enjoy. And I love teaching people. So I thought I'd put him to the test. What's 34 times 72? Quick, don't use a calculator. 2,448. You definitely used a calculator. Yeah, why would I have to stress myself when I can just make my life easier? So when are we going to make out? How did we just go from doing maths equation to asking when are we going to make out? I've been on Tinder for like five years and no one's ever messaged me saying, so when are we going to make out? Georgia just has something special. So I didn't reply to this because I was a bit creeped out. So then he just responded again. So is that a yes? Well, no. If someone doesn't reply to your question, it probably means no. Honestly, this is just the start as well. Let me show you some more of oh, this guy. This guy is probably the most desperate person I've seen on here and the last person that she asked to make out. So this guy is called JJ and no, it's not KSI, unfortunately. But he sent a message saying, hello, and put these three emojis. So Georgia said, hi, JJ, are you laughing at me? Haha, <laughs> no, I'm laughing at me winking and asking for a hug. Why would I be laughing at you, gorgeous? And hello. <laughs> at this point, I was like, JJ, I don't need you in my life. You're using emojis weirdly. I'm not going to reply. However, JJ didn't like that. So the next day, JJ replied, what are you up to? Again, I didn't reply. He then replied three hours later, question mark, question mark. And again, I didn't reply. So the next day, he said, good afternoon. How are you today? Any chance you fancy a meet? An hour later. Hello? I'm free all day if you fancy a drink or just to chill. The next day? That's a shame. Four hours later? Hey, how's your day been? No reply again. Hey, you all right? In the right corner, there's a shield. If you click it, you can unmatch me and you won't receive my messages. Would be good to meet and chat, but if you're not feeling it, that's okay. Four days later? Hey, question mark? He texts me 11 times without a response. At this point, JJ, you're just talking to yourself. If you try and talk to someone and they don't reply to you, you don't keep trying to talk to them. They don't <laughs> want to talk to you. You know what, JJ? I think I'm going to take you up in your offer and I'm going to unmatch you. All right, we matched someone called Sam and he sent us a whole paragraph. Hello, how's you? And hey, a bit more about me. Well, like yourself, I'd love to get given a chance by you to get to know you. That literally makes no sense. As for what I'm looking for, well, it's a lovely woman like yourself. So hey, if you feel like the same back, then hey. <laughs> This guy said hey like three times already. Anyway, looking forward to hearing back from you soon. Take care for now. I'm just gonna reply, okay. What else do you say to that? So here we match with Max, who sent us a heart face emoji. So I said, what does this mean? You're beautiful. Thank you. I'm over double your age. This guy was literally 20. I could be your mother. And this is where this gets interesting. Well, that's actually what I was going to ask. I'm an adult baby. What's an adult baby? So basically, I'm an adult, but I wear nappies and that like a baby. Uh, yeah, I never replied to that. I didn't really know how to, to how to respond to that. Edda messaged us. Hey, how's it going, Georgia? I also have a cat. Didn't ask. G. <laughs> Oh, I'm so rude, but it's so funny. All right, next I want to show this conversation I had with Reese, which by the way, they're all screenshots because spoiler alert, he unmatched me. Something in his bio said he liked football. So I said, my ex-husband was a footballer. Do you have good ball control then? No, not me, my ex-husband. OMG, sorry, I read that wrong. Ha ha, it's been a long day. He definitely didn't read that wrong. He was trying to flirt and I just said no flirting. So after this, I just didn't reply to him. So he then messaged again. Hello, Snapchat question mark. I'm 44. Why would I have Snapchat? Grow up. Who does he think he is? Messaging me just Snapchat. I'm a 44 year old woman. Now this got Reese a bit angry. So he replied, why would you have Tinder? So Sharon, what bottle of wine are we drinking with Facebook memes tonight? I'm not sure what he was trying to say here. I think he was trying to call me a basic middle-aged woman. Georgia is far from basic. So I had to let him know to meet people, not Snapchat them. Did you just call me Sharon? Respect my name, you child. I have high up friends who have husbands who work at Tinder. I can get you banned just like that. So think before you speak little boy. Georgia went off. Put some respect on Georgia's name. However, he then replied, listen, Melanie, I'll chef up your friends for a fiver. Is that a threat? No, Stacy, it's a promise. He then told me to shush. And he then followed up by saying, stop typing. <laughs> Honestly, I was kind of getting roasted here. So I said, did you just tell me to shush? You little weasel. <laughs> shush. <laughs> I'll beat you with a yoga mat, you big virgin. I have two kids, you imbecile. He did then reply to this, but I can't remember what he said. And then I said, respect me or I'll tell your mum. And he literally unmatched me. This guy was getting so loud telling me to shush. But then when I told him I'd tell his mum, he literally unmatched me. Tinder, what a funny place. All right, what else have we got? All right, Omar messaged me. Hey, you're so gorgeous. You got Snapchat? What is it with these young men thinking I have Snapchat? No, Omar, I don't use Snapchat because I'm 
mind, not well. If any of you guys wanted to add me on Snapchat, I also don't use Snapchat. Me and Georgia, we hate Snapchat. But if you did want to follow me on somewhere, go follow me on Instagram. Oh, here we've got another person. Here we've got Vedant, and he said, hello, Georgia. So I said, hello, Vedant. How's it going? Stupendously. What are you doing, Sugar Plum? <laughs> I thought it'd be funny to just call people pet names. Aw, Sugar Plum, working. Are you busy? Very busy. Are you busy? <laughs> so he then said, nope. Give me a shout once you're free, if that's okay with you. So I never replied. George is a busy woman, okay? The next day he then messaged, there. And again, didn't reply. Two days later, hi. Three days later, hello, Vedant. What don't you understand about me being busy? I literally said I messaged you when I'm free. If I haven't messaged you, that means I'm not free. So why are you messaging me every two days saying hello? Damien messaged us, who by the way is 21 years old. Live, laugh, love seems like the perfect motto. Damien, you're 21. No, it's not. You're not a Karen, okay? All right, what else is going on? Vittorio messaged us saying, perfect timing, just got back from my run. When? Wait for it, wait for it. Oh, the dad replied, oops, apologies. Ah, oh, I, I feel kind of bad now. Just joking, love you really. Callum messaged us, hello there, beautiful. Shush. <laughs> I'm still mad about reselling me to shush. I need to tell other people to shush. Oh, finally, Vittoro replied. So he told me he went for a run, so I said, when? What do you mean, when? I went for a run before. I've been waiting for this moment my whole life. No, when did I ask? That was so anticlimactic, <laughs> but it felt good. Oh, Oh, wow, okay. Oh, I feel rude. Ha, ha, only joking. Got you. I'm gonna send a gift. Oh, wait, I just remembered. I'm literally a gif on Tinder. Say, so if any of you are on Tinder and wanna flex on someone, send them a gif of me. I think you searched George Mason. Yeah, look, literally, I'm a gif on Tinder. This is my biggest accomplishment of all time. I'm gonna send this one. I knew we could do it. <laughs> I wonder if he's gonna realize that's also Georgia. And I'm gonna leave the video there. Honestly, what a weird video this has been. I thought going on to Tinder as a Karen would be a completely different experience. I didn't think the people would be this desperate to meet Georgia. Being a woman on Tinder is a completely different story. It's a lot easier to get matches and to get dates, but the stuff they have to deal with, I would not want to be one. I mean, I've been one. But yeah, guys, if you did enjoy, make sure you like the video. Let me know if you want to see a part two of Georgia Mason taken on Tinder again. And let me know any other stuff you want to see me do with Georgia. But if this video gets 10,000 likes, yes, 10,000, I'll do a part two where I head on to Tinder again as Georgia. So if you want to see that, let me know down below. Make sure you like the video so I know. If you are new, guys, make sure you subscribe for new videos every single Sunday and to join the George Mason Nation, the biggest catfish of all time. But yeah guys, if you enjoyed, make sure you like, comment and subscribe. It's been Georgia Mason and George Mason over and out. Boom.